Nearly half a million dollars. That is how much a teacher will get from the city of Austin because of a violent encounter with a police officer. The city council voted today to settle Breon King's civil rights lawsuit. When video of the arrest in 2015 surfaced, it sparked national outrage, and we want to warn you, it is difficult to watch. KVU political reporter Ashley Godot is here, and Ashley, the council members say today that this settlement is just the first step. That's right, Mike and Terry. Several council members reiterated that this type of behavior has to stop and that the men and women behind the badge must treat people with respect. Now we have some video of that June 2015 arrest. Breon King was stopped for speeding along Riverside Drive in the summer of 2015. You can see she is thrown to the ground. The arrest became the subject of an HBO documentary and several lawsuits, including one against the city of Austin, which alleges the officer used excessive force. Now, he has since been fired for a separate use of force incident. Today, the council voted unanimously to approve a $425,000 settlement with King over what happened. Any kind of settlement in these cases doesn't fix, doesn't fix, uh, doesn't fix things. Um, but I think in this case, it's in recognition from the city that we can and need to do better. Adler also said this incident was not Austin at its best, and he expressed concern over the comments from a federal judge that noted this incident and others in Austin suggest there is an institutional issue within the city's police department. Now, this incident happened while Art Acevedo was Austin's chief of police. Interim chief Brian Manley says he wants to talk with King about what happened. The city's law department is in the process of setting that meeting up. Mike? All right, thanks, Ash.